Well, here we are on day number 12 on the voyage of the Oasis of the Seas from Turku, Finland to Port Everglades, Florida. And we've got another beautiful, beautiful day in the Atlantic. We're about 245 nautical miles uh, away from Bermuda, and about 1.30 tomorrow morning, we'll be passing about 30 miles south of Bermuda. Behind me, we have the Safety Command Center on the Oasis of the Seas. It's a special place, and it's the first time we've had a, a facility just like uh, the Safety Command Center. What we've been able to do is to remove all of the non-navigational functions that typically are on the bridge of cruise ships, answering the emergency telephone, for example, monitoring closed-circuit television. We put it into the Safety Command Center. The result of that is that we have that all in one place, one unit, manned 24-7 by licensed uh, uh, deck officers. But the navigation bridge is isolated. We have sliding glass doors. We have them open now so that you can see a little bit better in. But we can close it off with sliding glass doors so that the navigation bridge is only for navigation. Uh, and it's really a great new uh, facility for the ship. And, uh, and again, one of the many features that is unique to the Oasis of the Seas. This is really the, the nerve center when something happens on board. Using these four screens is really a way that we can gain situational awareness for everybody who walks in the room. They can see what's going on immediately and get an overview of a situation and then use the screens for information purposes. One of the biggest innovations we have on this ship is our electronic mustering system. And that system is new in terms of how we muster our guests and how we account for everybody on board. And we do that using small PDAs where we can scan their CPAS cards. And in the safety center here, we can actually monitor the progress of mustering. This is the fire detection system for the entire vessel. We have all of our teams in the computerized systems where we can put them on location. We have all of our emergency checklists in the system so we can track what's going on. And then we can actually replay that back for training purposes. Overall, this, this concept and this design is, is really state-of-the-art, and it's the latest in the industry, and I don't think any other company has something like this, a dedicated safety center that is manned 24-7. Fire zone A, center as you pull. This ship is extremely safe, as well as the other ships in the fleet, but the platform we had here really allowed us to use innovation and use technology to even enhance the safety of the vessel.